One of my favorite parts of the body sex group is the genital show and tell. I love that ritual. It's so much fun. Oh, it's very powerful. Very powerful. I loved looking at all the women's vulvas. And, and then I loved being looked at myself. Well, this is, for me, this, this is the, the bonding moment yeah. of the workshop. After and that, everyone's equal and all the women yep. love each other. It's yep. just, we, all of a sudden, we realize we're all beautiful. We're all normal. If this is perfect, the variations are fabulous. And you celebrate the variations. That oh, was totally a great part. People totally. Were like, oh, yours is a little browner than oh, mine. Oh, look at this. Look oh, at I the like... mother of pearl. I love that color. Oh, I want a big clip like hers. No, no, no. I like the smaller ones. They're more feminine. I mean, the conversations. So real. <sighs> You've never had a conversation with another woman like that ever before. A group. You might have had it with a close girlfriend. And there's one thing about being in a shower together naked. There's another thing with... You sitting next to me on the floor, and my legs are spread, and I'm looking in a mirror at my vulva, and so is and I'm everyone looking, else. I'm looking in the mirror with you. And there's women all at your feet looking. It's And some of them are like this. <laughs> you know? What inspired the general show and tell? I simply started off by saying that I always felt I was genitally deformed because of my long inner lips, whereupon I opened my outer lips and showed my inner lips. So you're already naked at this point. Oh, we're all nude, yes, and we're sitting around. And I'm just having a conversation. So I demonstrate with no anticipation of anyone else doing it. And that's when Joan, my neighbor down the hall, goes, Oh, I have the same thing. And she goes, Bleh, Bleh. And so it was not It was totally informal. And it was then, organic. And then the next woman goes, Oh, look at my neighbor. I have it. And we discovered that long inner lips, extended inner lips, was the norm. That's the norm, not the, the It's the norm. Show. Yeah. Ugh. I tell you, at that moment, I, I almost passed out, you know, because <laughs> because of the energy that it released. Maybe that's it. Yes. It, I, I felt like when I went through the body sex group and after the general show and tell, it was like the room, there was a glow. We were sisterhood. We were women together. Nothing. Everything is revealed. There's nothing hidden. So is it about honesty? It's is it about, about sexual honesty? And just that and it's disclosure. Remember now, once a person is nude, they're not their clothes and they're not their style. They're who they are. And that's why I love being naked. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, and there's the other thing is that we always think that only beautiful young women can be nude. And in the room, we would have hefty mothers We'd have little flat titties. We'd have great big bazoombas. I love different bodies. I don't like the plastic Barbie doll body. Like, it's beautiful, don't get me wrong, but I like a range. Oh, the range is so exciting. That's why, I mean, the first time I went to a nudist colony, club, place, I mean, it was just like, oh, there was something so healing about body acceptance. Now, you accept your own body by looking at the variation yes. in everyone else's bodies. Yes. And what's going on today in the culture Every young woman hates her body. Well, look at the pressure. Once again, it was organic. I, and Joan, I never will forget that. She was a little short, round, English wife. Housewife. Who had the longest labia in the room? You? No, she did. And, oh no, All right, I'll, I'll, I'll confess, and, and the biggest clit. <laughs> no, and, and I went through a moment of like, Oh, her in, clitoris Betty. is bigger than mine. I thought I had, and I said, stop I thought I had it. the monster clit. Stop it, Betty. Yeah. <laughs> stop it's not it. a competition. <laughs> and we're doing really well on Kickstarter. Thank you, everyone. We're yes, really I'm so excited. Hitting all our numbers, and now we it looks like we have some corporate donations coming in. So it's very exciting. Yes, because it's going to happen. Our project is almost funded. Our project is going to happen. Stay tuned, and then you will see all the intimate details. Genital show and tell. All of it. All of it. Including my eye candy here. Getting <laughs> off. Boys. Just drop that one.